next point now let's quickly have a look into the historical background of electronic warfare within this chapter we would like to focus on real examples okay real military situations from the past here we have two clear examples two clear situations when and where electronic warfare capabilities have demonstrated a significant impact vietnam and iraq wars electronic warfare equipment was able to suppress and countermeasure mainly radar guide surface to air missiles as shown on the right side photo countermeasuring the guidance avoiding the impact on into airborne platform as fighters helicopter bombers etc in terms of evolution electronic warfare systems have evolved in such a way that independent product could be connected integrated with several equipment creating a full complex network example receivers and sensors installed on fighters could operate or communicate with equipment installed on vessels patrolling the coastline surveillance track driving through strategic mountains or even tanks checking conflict city centers and so on all about network another example we could mention here are strike fighters they were not allowed to operate without a suppression aircraft or fighter suppression platforms were implemented with jamming radars or anti-radiation missiles equipment therefore having this countermeasurement support a fighter could strike from higher altitude here more cool flying stuff right <laughs> so firstly the f-16 cj equipped with targeting system and anti-radiation missiles all in the 96 approximately and later on 2005 the ea6 bravo upgraded with jamming systems 